Now the On Your Side forecast with Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval. And latest stop the radar show scattered showers and storms up in the West Central Mountains. Heavy storms up uh, just west of Yellow Pine, it looks like, between McCall and Yellow Pine through some of the higher terrain. They're coming up through Long Valley showers and storms. Luckily, the lightning contained in these storms has a good deal of rain with it, but we could still get some fire starts with the red flag warning in effect. We had a flash flood warning near just north of Stanley. This will expire in 10 minutes as they had heavy rain here earlier. Moving further to the south, there's a storm system moving up through Horseshoe Bend. Don't see any heavy rain over the fire. This is where the fire is right here. You can see smoke showing up uh, right in this spot. This little light blue in here. There were showers nearby, so some erratic winds are likely around here. Showers and storms to the south here moving to the north seem to be weakening, but we're going to keep an eye on this. So isolated showers and storms are possible overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. As this continues to move to the north, eventually it will dry on out. Let's move on now and take a look at what's happening with a red flag warning in effect. Eastern Oregon, the Owyhee Mountains, uh, up in Payette National Forest here, uh, the Treasure Valley Upper Weezer River Basin, nothing here, but again, the magic valley. We're getting lightning in a lot of locations. Let's hope we can get some rain to come with most of these storms, but any dry lightning strikes likely to cause fires as the tinder is very, very dry out there. Flash flood watch has been now expired here, but flash flood watch further uh, to the north. Temperature wise, we got 100 degrees in Boise, then a heavy shower came over Boise. We got a hundredth of an inch of rain. It was a brief downpour, dropped the temperature to 90. Now it's back up to 97. 100 amount at home after a heavy shower came on through, and there are still those isolated showers here overnight this evening and, and later tonight we have the threat into the Treasure Valley tomorrow morning till about 10 or 11 o'clock in the morning the threat for showers and storms here as the sunshine builds in from the south once tomorrow goes by that's it for the cloud cover I mean hot sunny conditions developing as all that moisture continues to come in uh, from the south all that uh, hot weather continues to come in from the south and a huge ridge of high pressure is going to build on in so hot weather right here there's a big H sitting off to the south and to the east and that's bringing moisture up from the south but that H is going to build to the west bringing with it the heat and it's going to block the moisture keeping it to the south as it does so when that H moves right over here, it'll keep the storm staying to our east. That'll make us hot and dry. And I'm seeing some of the hottest weather we've seen in some time coming across the west as we move through the week of several days over 100 degrees. In fact, we'll get to that forecast right now. Treasure Valley coming up for tonight. Isolated showers and storms. Otherwise, we'll get partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, 100 in Weezer, 98 in Meridian, 100 in Vail, 101 in Mountain Home. So officially at the airport, I'm going to go with 99 degrees, so maybe not 100. But boy, we are still talking about hot temperatures coming Again, West Central Mountain forecast some showers and storms tonight and tomorrow morning, and then clearing later in the day. Same thing, morning storm, Stanley Sun Valley, Magic Valley tomorrow. A stray storm is possible, getting real hot in the 90s. And look at this extended forecast here a couple of 99s, then 101 and a couple of 104s on Sunday and Monday into Tuesday as well. This is a strong ridge of high pressure. Computers have a hard time forecasting 107 and 108, they just don't like it because it very seldom happens. But I can tell you this, that 104 on Sunday and Monday could yeah. end up being a 106 or a 107 as we get closer. Stay tuned. All right, thanks, Scott. Coming up next.